just been so like out of it in terms of like vlogging i will touch on this in a video sometime like when i'm ready the gist of it is just that i've been dealing with some mental health issues i just honestly i just felt like i didn't want to vlog i didn't have any personality for it not that you need like a personality but like i just felt like i didn't want to like share my downside all that much on the internet if you watched my previous video i don't know when i posted that probably like three weeks ago maybe um you'll notice in that vlog that i was feeling a bit down but i was sick in that one i think i'm not sick now i do remember like i was feeling like really down then um but yeah i'll touch on that in a completely different video like when i am ready but you know what i thought i would pick up the vlogging camera and just start it's so crazy to think that when people ask like like i get messages and stuff like over the years i've gotten messages and things of like girls asking me like how do you start this career like how did you start this like where do i start you know and the one thing that i always say is to just start like start that account or start your youtube channel like just start it and obviously you need to plan ahead and things like that but i mean like by you just initiating something that that's already a step and right now i'm just going to take my own advice and do that um so i thought i would just start a new vlog and i don't know how long this is going to be but here we are <laughs> i actually got some motivation you can call it that from jess so i am busy working on a video at the moment but i also have my other laptop here and i'm watching youtube videos hence why my earphone is in my ear um i'm watching jessica jessica if you are watching this just know that you motivated me to start hi uh, are you no i'm actually vlogging oh, we're lost so yeah, I was watching one of her things now and I'm just like, this is so nice to just watch. And I feel like because that's how I feel watching this video now, I think it's like a random video of hers that she posted yesterday. But because I'm enjoying this so much, I like took a step back and just sort of did like some introspection. That's probably how you guys feel about my videos as well when you watch them. At the moment, I am currently editing, or oh, I just actually finished a video that I am doing for my Instagram. It's literally just from like, it's not sponsored content or anything. It's just a foundation review that I wanted to do. And yeah, I just finished it and I'm probably gonna post it tonight. So yeah, that will go up tonight. It's my Elizabeth Arden foundation like review. Very exciting, but we are getting a kitten tomorrow and we have absolutely nothing like so bad at like just doing it like i said to lorenzo we were supposed to do it on the weekend but both of us just like so i really want to go get some kitten things like i like just like the basics for now and then obviously like we can build up from there but yeah we're getting our kitten tomorrow night we're gonna go fetch her but i want to go get like a litter box and food and a little bed and stuff so excited but also nervous i wanted to show you guys some new items that i got we all know that i do enjoy showing you guys what's new in my wardrobe and all those kinds of things so the first like two things that i want to show you is two bottles of perfume that i recently got and i really like both of these like equally the one i bought myself and the other one i actually received yesterday is like a press drop 
and I really like it. Like I smelt it and I was like, this is so great. This one I can give you more of like an actual like review if you want to call it that. Um, so this one I got from Zara. It's called Wonder Rose. And um, this is what the bottle looks like. It's kind of like this. It's literally just like a see-through big bottle. It's a really heavy. Gosh, and this is a 200 ml um, that I got from Zara and it smells exactly like what it says. It's like this rose, like it's quite sweet though. So I don't really spray a lot of it on, but it smells so like girly and fresh. That was the first thing that I that I thought like when I smelled it in the store. I was like, this smells really fresh. 339 red. It was something that lasts like really long on me and smells really pretty and then this one is the second one that i received yesterday so this is the michael kors gorgeous this is what the bottle looks like and it's quite like an interesting design it's just got like this slanted situation on the side there and this one oh so nice oh my word this one is a also, this is a hundred ml. That Michael Kors one is more of like floral, but then it's also got a little bit of like woodiness to it. There's I think there's tobacco in there as well, like the scent. Really, both of those I really want to share them because I was like, this smells so good. And then for the pieces that I want to show you that I got recently that I actually didn't show you in my previous vlog because I don't think I even shared like any items that I got, but I'll share it now. Um, so I bought, so I got these trousers recently. If you have been following me for a while, I have posted the black pair like this, like last year. And then I see they came out with this cream, like pleather pair, and it's the exact same as the black one, but it's obviously just like in this cream color, which is, I am so happy about this because this is like my tones. It's the same colour as my, no, it is the same colour as my, my tracksuit pants. I'm so excited to style them, like with some nice boots and like a coat. Like even these two could work. Then I got two shackets. So this is the one, I posted this one in a, in a selfie and like an outfit of the day. So this one is from H&M and I actually got this one on sale. It was like six or seven hundred rand and I got it for three hundred. And then there's this one. This is new stock. So this will definitely still be in H&M if you are interested. This, this wasn't a sale item though, but I really, really love the colors. Like, and this was the one that I posted recently in um, my body shop video. This is the pullover that I bought from H&M. If you guys saw my post that I did with H&M, it was a pullover like this. I actually shot it with this pullover, which is also from H&M, but however, this one isn't being launched here in South Africa. So I see that they launched this one. I have the darker, like beige, like this jersey, but I just love this color. So I just bought this one as well. Um, this one is a small and it is 379 so it is quite long it goes like down my thighs but this is really nice for winter and then this is another jersey that I got from Zara that I really like it comes in like a baby blue color as well and then there's this one obviously I'm gonna get this one because of my tones that I like to wear and like how versatile everything is. So yeah, this is from Zara. I know this crop vibe is not for everybody. However, I wear high-waisted jeans and that's it doesn't become a problem. Um, I really, really like this knit. It actually just came out the washing, so it's smelling so nice. <laughs> Alright, so it's been a little while since I lost spoke to you guys. I have different jeans on <laughs> um, and I'm getting it done at the moment we are like I told you guys we're gonna be like I told you guys we're gonna be going to the shop to go get the kitty things but I forgot to show you this knit that I got um, as part of like some items that I got in recently so I got this from H&M and it's quite oversized this is an extra small and 
I haven't worn it, the price is still on here. So yeah, this is an extra small, it was four twenty nine. It's like typical, the minute I see some kind of like cold weather, I'm like, oh, yes, opportunity to wear like my winter outfits. Um, I saw this jersey on the mannequin actually. Fix my hair. My hair has been straight for the past like two weeks and then today was when I washed it. <laughs> I did wash it between those two weeks. I mean, like I washed it and then I straightened it again. But this is the first time it's been curly in two weeks and I don't know how to act. I really like this like slit here as well. This bag is just like country road stuff that I was shooting, which those posts will be going up. The one's going up tonight. But yeah, this is my outfit. I'm gonna change this jersey. Sorry, I know I literally just showed you, but I'm actually burning up. Alright, so I just put the other jacket on. That word is so weird to me. It sounds like I want to say jacket and show jacket, which I like. Just like this oversize. We have arrived at Canal Walk. Hi guys. You haven't seen me in a while. Yes. You haven't seen Paula in a while. So we came to the checkers pet section. They have like mostly just like food and like doggy treats and stuff um, but we got like some basics like litter and like this um, kitten food. Is that all we got? Oh yes and we got this. We got throwback. Oh yeah I saw, odors I saw this on take a lot. Um, so I want to go to the pet store that's like next door and then go see what they have because I don't like these bowls. I don't even know if you guys will be able to hear me, but we came to Rafa Moments um, for supper. Hey! And that's lovely on the top. It's a mic. Oh. So we came to Rafa Moments for supper. Also, the cat shopping was a success. Was a success. But I'll show you guys the stuff tomorrow um, when I'm like. In nice lighting and I'm back home. Eager to eat. Hey guys, so it is the next day. Today is Thursday and it's around half past no, it's like 10 past two. Um, I just got to the clay cafe now. I'm outside and I am already late. I have to go inside like right now. But I just wanted to say hi and tell you guys where I am. So I'm meeting Lashal and Akila here. Yeah, we're just going to spend some time together. We haven't seen each other as like a group in a while. Kiara was all supposed to come but she couldn't make it. So yeah, like we're just going to have a chilled afternoon sesh. <laughs> we came to the one in the city, by the way. These are all the colors. Definitely feeling these vibes over here. <laughs> actually at that place but anyway whatever and I realized that I didn't show you guys the kitty things so I'm gonna show you that quickly and then we are gonna go fetch oh, why am I getting shy we're gonna go fetch the cat okay so we got this little tray for like the food and the water this is from the brand Ollie and Max by the way all these things that I'm showing you is from either checkers or Absolute pets uh, in Canal Walk. The food tray. Got a scooper for the litter box. Um, I got this collar, which I think might be a bit too big in the beginning. I love how I'm showing you this, like it's a product. Like, 
like makeup or something but yeah this is the color the lady in the shop said that um it should be fine for like an eight week nine week kitten but we'll see and then i also got a harness because the cat will be going with me places um like especially if i go like to my parents or something then i would want the cat to put it on a leash i got this litter tray so i watched this thing yesterday where they said that shouldn't have a lid um when they're still really young i can obviously take the lid off um but we'll see like how it goes in the beginning i feel like i might just have to keep it like this so that the cat can like get in and out quite easily and it's also quite shallow so yeah the lid is obviously just so that the litter doesn't like fall out or they kick it out of the, the box anyway so yeah we're gonna go fetch been a bit crazy we got bailey which is our new little ginger kitten uh, we finally got a kitty which is crazy to think about like Lorenzo and i kept like the day before we kept like saying to each other like this is really weird like we're gonna have a cat tomorrow so yeah we got him on thursday and i haven't really filmed anything actually just because like i've been in this little like cat bubble lol but i wanted to come on here and show you guys what i got from faithful to nature so i saw that they opened up a store in the waterfront i'll show you what i got so i got another one of these squin wrap me up therapy face creams and i got the smaller one just because i'm currently using this one which is the bobby brown vitamin enriched face base and this is a very popular moisturizer people use it as a moisturizer or a primer like and also um the squirn in faithful to nature was having a 25 percent of like sale of everything i don't think it was it's like a flash sale basically so yeah i got an, another one of these and if you guys remember a good couple of vlogs back i spoke about this moisturizer it's so tiny compared to the one the bigger one that i had quite a big difference like in terms of the size this one is like 700 the big one it's like 750 so i got a smallie i got one of these this is a full size one this is the squin o sherbet exfoliating mask so i used a sample of this one and i'm glad that i used the sample first so i could see if i liked it or not um, and this is also 25% off. This is the box. Squid always has like such like clean looking packaging. Like simple, clean. And you actually have to put water into it. And you don't have to use a lot. So this is actually what it looks like. It's like a powder. So you just put a little bit of water like in a, like a small container. And then it turns into like pasty. And then you can put it on your face. And then the last thing I got is this, the Harvest Table. So I've used their collagen before. At the moment, I'm using Pomegranate Wellness, their collagen. So this one, the Harvest Table, they have come out with hot chocolate. So it's literally pure collagen hot chocolate, um, which I think is so interesting. I am yet to try it. I mean, I just got this small one. And the small one is like 200 something rand. But it's because it's got collagen in it. Say hi. Look, look. What's that? How weird do I look? I have to hold the camera like this because there's literally a guy in the car next to me. And I feel so awkward because I feel like he's going to look at me. And I don't listen for that. I wanted to just show you guys and take you guys with me um, along the way for getting my nails done today i'll show you guys what they currently look like and then i'll just show you like little snippets along the process i probably won't speak but i just thought i'll show you anyway <laughs> this is what they currently look like they are grown out as you can see um and my cuticles are quite dry today um yeah you can see that they've grown out quite a bit
the mosque. The struggle. Hello. <laughs> and Anyway, um, I just got home now from that event. Such a scorcher. Say hi. Cute, the face. I actually wanted to end this vlog, but I wanted to show you guys this dispenser thing that I got at Woolies. So this is what it looks like. And it's a dispenser kit. So when you are like walking with your animal or you guys are traveling or something, and you need to obviously dispose of the like poo, then this is little kit let me show you quick so it looks like this like a little dog bone and it's like um silicone it's got a hook so you can hook this to like the leash or to your bowel i don't know where else you would hook this maybe a bag these little bags like roll out and you are they are ones um that's like a refill that you can get at woolies so yeah, I got this at Woolies in the pet section. I haven't given it a shot yet. It's literally, I just got it now. I really want to like use this for Bailey's waste, if you want to call it that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.